the false economy of cheaper. Um, when you when you get things like Big Macs, you get your KFCs, etc. The portions are actually smaller. You've got to understand they've adapted the business to the east. They're not expecting Western and Westerners there. They eat Western size. You find things are a little bit smaller. The portions are smaller, but even the burger patties, etc., are smaller. That's why there's a false belief it's actually cheaper when the fact is it's probably more expensive when you do it on an exchange rate conversion because the meals are actually smaller, um, which is something to be aware of. Because it's very hard to do a direct comparison on something when they're not exactly the same. The other side of this being, you shouldn't be eating that stuff anyway. There's plenty of other better stuff out there. Um, if you make your own burgers, get to the markets. The wet markets is where basically your meat and fish come from. That's what they call it locally. Get there in the morning, early the better, because by the afternoon it's got the old fly swinging around on it. <laughs> it's, it's not a refrigerated area. Fish sometimes are kept overnight. Fish are kept in uh, ice buckets that are... You'll see them. They're like cool boxes where they just pack the ice and keep the fish and stuff in it. That's how a lot of that stuff is looked after. If you pay a bit more, you can get it from the supermarkets where it's more of a mass production type thing where the quality is better and the butchering can be a bit better. But we will also say, be aware, butchering is an art form in the West. It's more like a massacre sometimes in the East, where doing a chicken, for example, we have a guy that does our chicken. He gets a meat cleaver and basically just puts on a wooden block and just gives it somewhere that he just hammers it as if he's trying to kill the thing. Um, that's not what I call butchering. Uh, it's something that's been uh, massacred. <laughs> but that's the thing. You won't get the fine cuts. The supermarkets may do it, but you, you're limited. If you're looking for certain parts of the meat and stuff, you're in for a big surprise because most places don't do it. There is some places that do it, but you need to find them. Um, it's something that you should ask on forums because other people understand the food. They'll understand what your frustration is. They'll tell you where to get the stuff from if it's available. Mm.